Hey YouTube, I wanted to give you an update. Don't mind those boxes. That's stuff we have to wrap for Christmas presents. But anyway, um, I'm going to show you at the end of this video um, how my bikes look. But I just want to talk to you about trying to be positive because I have been super sad, super depressed, ashamed. Um, because if I go anywhere, they're going to think, first of all, they're probably going to think I'm on drugs. And second of all, they're going to think I'm nasty. Um, I've dealt with this my whole life because I have acne from having PCOS, but, um, I always feel like people judge me for my skin and it doesn't matter how clean of a person you are. If your skin looks bad, people are going to probably have, um, thoughts about you and I'm guilty of it myself. Seeing somebody with a bunch of bug bites or a bunch of marks on their skin, I would probably look at them and think, you know, either they're nasty, they do drugs or something, but maybe they just had an unfortunate event happen to them and it's out of their control. Or maybe they live in an apartment and they try to keep their house as clean as they can, but bugs come from other places. Um, so either way, it's just not good to judge anybody. You don't know anybody's story, but this is my story. Um, I want to talk to you about being positive because I have been super sad, super depressed and ashamed, and I don't want to go anywhere to these heal. Um, it could take up maybe to two weeks to heal. I hope not because it's almost Christmas time. Last Christmas, we had COVID for Christmas. This year, we have bed bug bites for Christmas. <laughs> but the positive to it is if we would have found the bugs, like we always check, we just had been in October and we checked our beds and we stayed for five days and did not get one bite. Um, so if we would have went in our hotel and we would have checked like we always do, we would have found them and we probably would have spent the day in just aggravation and probably my husband would have wanted to come back home and I was already scared about storms and I wanted to escape it. So that would have kind of just been exhausting. So the good thing about it is we did have the most wonderful time we got to look at Christmas lights. We saw ice skaters. They were outside. And it was funny because it was during the day and it was so hot that the ice was melting. And so we got to, we just got to see a bunch of good stuff. We got to eat some delicious food. Um, we ate at a place called Nacho Hippo, I think, or something like that. And we had some shrimp. We had um, steak and, um, I was about to say enchiladas, but that's not it. We had steak quesadillas <laughs> with mushroom and onion and it was just so good we went to crazy mason we had a blast and if we would have found the bed bugs before then we would not have got to do any of that i'm sure we would have been stressed out and then the second thing is if we didn't bring anything home which so far we have not seen a single thing and we've cleaned everything we could possibly clean um all i have to show for it is just my arm so hopefully we won't let just the misery I've been in in the last few days ruin our special time we had together because we did have a very good trip. But I'm going to show you my arm and give you an update. It is Wednesday. Um, This happened Sunday night is when I started itching. So this is what it looks like still on Wednesday. I don't know what the best way to show you this is. The itching's not as bad as it was. My flash just went off. All the way up my arm. All the way down my hand. Side of my hand. Hopefully you see this. So if you're going through this, the best thing to do is just stay positive, keep everything clean. Um, people make bed bugs out to be like they're super contagious, but they actually have to get onto stuff, crawl onto stuff and stay on stuff to get, you know, transported anywhere else. So as long as you clean what you have, clean your clothes, take a bath, um, and you know, wash whatever you have, um, you should be okay. So thank you for watching this video. I hope I can heal fast and be in better spirits for the holiday this year. But thank you for watching. I hope you have a great day.